Hi, in this um, video, we're going to show you how to build and run analytics on diagrams in System Architect. And you can run these analytics on any diagram. We're going to use a business capability map. This is one in, in, uh, on the screen. These are business capabilities that have higher level capabilities that they are uh, drawn within. And this is the um, higher level capability in this case. Uh, product sales and service it knows that it has children drawn within it and um, if we if we drilled into one of these business capabilities we'll see that it is related to a number of things in the business uh, in this case we have it related to um, a business service layer so we have business service layer here um, that enable the capabilities and if we drove into the business service, we can see it has uh, a number of things related to it, including the applications, the physical applications that enable the business service. And so we have something here called STR, and we open its definition. We see it's a physical uh, application. It, it is strategic, and it also has portfolio information. Uh, in this case, uh, it's in service date. It's effective date. It has no sunset date yet. It has costs associated with it. Uh, we have here on page two, uh, costs per time period. So a purchase cost and maintenance cost projected out into the next few years. And all of that is totaled up in a total cost property. Now that information uh, you may have imported uh, from a source of record. Uh, you may be putting it into the tool directly. You may be customizing the properties to add your own. Um, sets of fields to capture various costs uh, for your applications in your business. Um, so um, let's now take a look at this business capability map. We want to build an analytic that will color um, capabilities a certain color uh, to denote that um, they're low cost, the application serving the business service, serving the capability a low cost application. So I'm going to use something called a heat map manager, which is a useful tool in System Architect. It enables you to um, use wizards to build analytics and explore reports to visualize things on diagrams and also to collect reports that you've built. Uh, so we'll use this analytic wizard to get um, capabilities um, uh, with low cost uh, based on application cost. Okay, so that's an analytic that we're going to build. And you have to have a report that will get the information. So we push the create button and we are into System Architects reporting engine, a built-in SQL reporting engine. So I'm going to choose business capability um, and it's going to be related to a business service. So we're doing SQL joins as we drive down here and that's going to be related to we have a number of different relationships but um, that is implemented by an application and not just any kind of application but a physical application so i'll set is physical equal true and then i want to have um, the total cost property so again these these all the properties are reflected here for the application including those that you've added uh, through customization of the meta model but total cost i want to be equal to, or less than i should say less than ten thousand uh, $10,000 total cost over a period of years. And um, so I've built my first uh, report. And then I want to say, um, okay, if, if, that, um, if it finds a capability where you have a low cost application, color it white, um, choose a pen style of say a dashed line, maybe a pink color, uh, and then override that, that width uh, make it thicker, um, the line. Uh, and then I'll put an icon next to it as well. And you usually use one, one of these, but I'll just overload this to show you what you can do. And so um, 
I have I'm looking at the files table of my database here and I've got some some uh, nice graphics in here I want to use say a um, a red a red gauge that'll you know low cost applications are associated with that capability so um, I create a collection now as to collect a, a several analytics that I'll build and I and um, my heat map manager automatically updates to show my uh, my new analytic and I can run that and it, and it does what I what I asked it to do I didn't ask it to put it put the icon in a particular place so um, what I'll do now is access what I've just built the analytics the analytic collection analytic report are all become definitions in system architect so you can reuse them you can move them between encyclopedias you can edit them so what I'll do is I'll go to that analytic which is uh, capabilities with low cost and here's the report that I built it's pointing at uh, but the here's the depiction but I'll choose um, to specify it, uh, it shows at the top right um, say outside the uh, the capability and I, I can rerun that now and in a place in the, where I asked it to so um, so that's it that's how you build and run analytics and system architect and the world is your oyster and in, in terms of the kind of report and the kind of graphics you want to apply now uh, a couple of tricks here if I wanted to reuse these analytics I could do that as well so I could come over to um, that low cost uh, uh, capabilities and do a, a copy uh, and say let's get uh, medium cost application uh, capabilities right and um, and then I can come in to that new analytic and um, I want to change this because this is the report getting low cost one but before I do that let me go over and choose a different analytic uh, go to those gauges and get a uh, amber one and then remove that red one and then also uh, choose a new color say uh, well it was white let me let me turn it orange and change the pen uh, the, the pen color to orange okay uh, and then um, what I want to do is go over to the report of capabilities with low cost and uh, before I open that up let me copy it and get one for medium cost and change that uh, report so that at the lowest level when it gets the application cost it is uh, say greater than or equal to 10,000 or total cost is say less than maybe a hundred thousand okay over a period of years so um, that's a medium cost application and then we want to go into the um, well we want to go back to the analytic first which is the uh, capabilities with uh, medium cost and change out that report okay and then finally we go to the analytic collection capability cost and choose that new analytic to add okay we have both of them now refresh our browser or our or heat map manager I should say and um, and then run both analytics okay and so that's how to uh, build 
and run uh, analytics and system architect. Uh, thanks for watching.